and uh, all, almost tenants, you know, like 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 a little bit like white wine, white wine tenants. It's quite special to me, and uh, of course we got the green notes uh, with the fish, um, very beautiful. Uh, some sake, mm -hmm. with this uh, course, which I quite enjoy, it's called Sishiken Velvet. As I said, we only work with Jumai Daijunji, which is the highest grade quality and um, velvet referring to the water they use, it's very smooth and therefore resulting in a very smooth sake. But in this one we find a lot of umami flavors, again the saltiness, which I think is very nice with the uh, soul. Okay. Um, so as you might know, Toru is half Japanese um, and he likes to spend time in Tokyo, where he's from. So his father still has a house in, in Tokyo. Um, when he's in Tokyo, he can't really go to the fine dining places because he has two kids, they're very small. And um, so he thought of, you know, where could I take my son? He's a few, four years old now. And uh, so he went to Shibuya. Uh, Shibuya is uh, a little bit like Soho in London. It's where people go out and it's where they celebrate the street cuisine you know the, the little skewers, uh, the grilling uh, eels, um, also the gyozas and the ramen uh, soups and uh, you know we thought because we're big fans of that style of cooking but we can't do it up here right because it's fine dining too much stars. So we thought you know how can we bring that atmosphere and that style of food a little bit closer to the guest. Um, so you know I'm just gonna take you to Shibuya now. This is my Wonderful, welcome to Shibuya. And what we have here is called nabe. Uh, it's very Japanese, uh, very classic Japanese also. Mm -hmm. And it's basically a little bit like a Chinese hot pot or like a fondue. Yeah. So you have a boiling broth in here. Um, in this case it's uh, a dashi uh, with some fresh ginger. There's some chili in there, some leek um, and some uh, shiitake mushrooms. And uh, I'm just gonna put this beautiful pork belly in here, so this is a uh, German pork belly uh, with uh, pre grilled in it and cooked in sous vide and I'm just gonna glaze it a little bit with that uh, beautiful dashi that we have here and just warm it up and give it some more flavor, you know, a little bit of that uh, umami and saltiness. Um, the uh, uh, steamed rice balls uh, with some braised meat on top, mostly it's beef or chicken. Um, it's freshly grated uh, ginger and uh, some radish. Um, next is uh, a three-year-old soy sauce with uh, golden sesame oil. Golden sesame oil is among the best sesame oil you can get. So also very Japanese, you know, it's all about quality. And then last, um, we have this beautiful uh, bonito that we've just created here. So it's this piece here. Go right ahead, enjoy.
we have uh, the English garden and we started our journey at the uh, Wernicke bei Geisel um, uh, with the uh, butter, with the uh, Japanese butter and uh, we are now doing a journey through the English garden, one of the, the biggest parks and gardens in uh, Germany and also in Munich.